little garter snake. I don't want to scare him, but... He's just hanging out here. Non-toxic. Not a... Um, not a constrictor. They just kind of grab the prey and just gulp it down. Very cool. I love snakes. Greetings one and all, how's everyone doing? I hope you guys are doing well. Please excuse the traffic noise behind me. I'm just at a local natural area again. And uh, they must have known I was coming because they all decided to come flying down the road and being noisy. Excuse me. So this is the, uh, the seven questions of YouTube. Here are the questions. I'll also put them in the description as well. Nobody tagged me that I know of. If you did and I didn't see the video, my apologies. But I thought it would be interesting to, to do the video plus, you know, for new subscribers who hadn't, who don't really know me as well. Like, well, who is this guy? Maybe they just kind of decided to sub just for the heck of it. So, why do you YouTube? Question number one. The reason I YouTube it, the reason I started YouTube is because originally I wanted to get better with the ferro seam rod. So that's why my channel at first was very heavy on fire and fire making because I just wanted to get better with it. But now I still want to get better at it, but that's not why I continue to do YouTube. I do it because it's fun. That's, I, I, I camp because it's fun. I hike because it's fun. I go outdoors and do outdoor things because it's fun so that's why I don't really get too bent out of shape about um, technique or how things should be done or gear or weight none of that crap matters to me as long as I have a good time that's what matters to me I want to have fun I you know I work all week I sometimes have to work a lot of overtime and I want to relax unwind and do what I like you know I also like to watch football and during football season you know so for I uh, lost my train of thought so yeah fun that's why I continue why do you YouTube because it's fun where'd you get your channel name it's interesting because I got my channel name off of a cartoon squirrel foamy uh, in one of his in one of his uh, tunes there's a photo in the back with a bagel and it had uh, it said e carbs underneath the picture. I'll roll in the photograph here so you can check it out if I can find it. So there you go, great channel. I'll link it below. I just thought it was funny. I, I ended up taking it when I had um, MySpace, which was man, a long time ago. I was like, oh, haha, ha, that's funny. Typed it in, just kind of went with it. How long have you been on YouTube? So I started my channel uh, June 6, 2006, so nine years. My first video upload was uh, February 6, 2014, so I've been doing this. I've been uploading videos for three years, well, over three years. Actually, I missed my three year anniversary by two months. So I currently have 564 videos, which just seems like a lot. I mean, for at first I was just cr I was cranking them out like every day I was out I was making video, but I had different hours at work then, and so it was easier to get out and film. And I had a little park I could go to, shoot a few fire making videos, and so on and so forth. And I cut down to every other day, and then now it's just when I can get out I film like today. When I'm, you know, when I'm busy or just don't feel like coming out, I just don't because, you know, if, we, if you're not in the mood to make videos, it makes poor videos, I think. So, 
Uh, what camera do you use? I use the Olympus Tough Shot, which was recommended by Adam at Wood Tick Camping. I will, Wood Tick Outdoors. Sorry if I messed up your channel name, brother. I will link his channel below. Cool guy. Good videos. Too bad he's, he lives so far away. It's, it's uh, you know, can't just go hang out. Which is, seems to be the case in most. Let's see. Number five, do you use your own thumbnail? Or do you make your own thumbnails? I do not. Uh, I feel like I've gotten pretty lucky with the, when I upload a video, it just it just generates a thumbnail for you. So, I've actually been pretty fortunate to get halfway decent thumbnails, but I don't make my own thumbnails. It's just, I'll just load up the video as it is. Uh, do you make your own intros and outros? I used to. Or you know, do you make your own intros? And I did. It was just like a clip of a river, or uh, we came across a small waterfall one day. So I will uh, go ahead and throw a couple of intros and uh, um, intros here, so you can see for those of you who've never seen them. Get to it. I just don't use them anymore. No one really seemed to mind that I, I wasn't uh, using them, so I just kind of stopped using them. Sorry, I'm always trying to look. I always try to maintain like what's around me. Plus, it might be a good like I saw a garter snake, which I'm going to show at the beginning. That uh, you know, by always keeping an eye out, I can I might see something I want to film. Like if I saw an owl sitting up in a branch. I would just stop everything and get him on fi film. His owls are awesome. Plus, you know, it may be a Sasquatch behind me and I want to get him on video. So, and question number seven, will you ever quit YouTube? Probably, you know. Well, here's the thing. When it stops being fun, I'll stop making videos. I mean, at some point I'm going to get probably too old or my health might fail suddenly or... I'll get, you know, drop kicked by a squatch and I'll be all messed up and I can't film or can't get outside anymore, then videos will stop. Because I don't, I don't really like doing just tabletop videos. I've done a few. I don't really dig them as much. It's like, yeah, I think it shows when people watch them. It's like, you know, if you're not into what you're doing, it's like, well, you know, why make, why make it then? So... So I guess that's it. That's the seven questions. So if you have any additional questions, uh, put them below and I will answer or I will do a video. If I, if I get a lot of questions, I'll, uh, I'll just do another video and respond to your questions. I used to do Q&A videos, but I haven't done one in a long time. So now is your chance for new subscribers, which are, I appreciate your sub and thank you. And uh, have a good one. I'll catch you on the next video.